Hello there and welcome back to the channel. So today a really quick video, a one shot of uncollected Thanos and this month event quest. So I know there will be some people struggling with him, so I just wanted to put first of all a quick video out there of showing how perfect Hyperion is to counter this guy. And then afterwards, uh, in a day or two, I'll probably post videos on how to defeat all of the new bosses. But anyways, for now, so we're using Hyperion, we have rank 5 Hyperion, we don't have suicides or any other special mastery setups. Uh, we start the fight off by launching uh, a lot of heavy attacks and building up our furies. And then as soon as he enters his first phase, we launch our special 3 to kind of disable it and allow him to... Oh, there I was just checking if I was recording. But yeah, anyway, so as soon as he uses his first phase, we just launch special 3 to disable it and be safe to parry him and attack him. And from there, we're basically going to be trying to stunlock him with our level 2s and deal as much damage as possible. So, uh... I don't think I had the best RNG in this fight, and I definitely will be making some mistakes, but it shouldn't be anything too difficult there. We get some good shots in, and if we do not happen to stun him, always just try and block bait the heavy attack out, because Hyperion is quite bulky and he doesn't hit all that hard, so for most part you can just block bait heavies uh, if you do not want to deal with his specials too much. And as soon as he enters the third phase, we dash at him, so we and finish a combo with light attack, that means uh, reverse controls are off and for the duration of this phase we're just going to be spamming our level 1 attack and block baiting heavy attacks it's also like super easy to do, just hold your block down, let him launch that heavy attack once he does, uh, just hit your level 1 and you can be sorted so because that's damage over time debuff, so his safeguard isn't really affected here he decides to launch a special attack but we can evade it now we do a quick intercept, finish a combo with light attack, do our level 2, hopefully stun him. And yeah, from here on out, we can go back to spamming our level 1 attack, just because of those incinerates, to bypass the safeguard he has, which is quite annoying. And another level 2, unfortunately, even though we were blocking, sometimes he still throws them. But yeah, and now he's nearly at the phase. And do apologize for any background noise, I'm recording these at work, so uh, my bad about that. But anyways, he's nearly at his last phase, we can't stun him anymore because he's under 40%. But yeah, he's nearly entered his final phase, which is like kind of the most annoying one, but it's actually not too difficult once you get used to it. Now he activates his last uh, stone, and here I mess up a bit, which is unfortunate, but it's all well. So anyways, the plan here is to kind of... Uh, dash back intercept him and because every time we do we do get the armor ups transferred and we actually can do damage so at this point uh, we already have done like five percent from his 30 percent phase level three does another five percent and now again hopefully he doesn't launch special three instantly now he does but he's at 18 percent already so we do have heimdall synergy so we are going to survive this level three but that's going to be about it we don't we are not allowed any more mess ups and yeah here we kind of like just hit him a couple times dash back intercept and now i'm kind of in hairy waters but i just need to get one level three off and now we have 15 armor breaks on him level three and the fight is almost over anyways guys if you did enjoy the video please feel free to subscribe and like it and share it with your guy uh, with your friends and there's going to be a lot more interesting content to come and explanation and some more videos about this guy and others so see you guys next time